What's up guys, Kebabs here, back with another video. I know it's been a while, but I had um, other stuff that I needed to do so I couldn't really be making videos. But yes, you heard the title, you saw the title. We are back with the Mob Drops Challenge again. Hopefully this time I can actually complete it though. Anyways, enough of the chatting. Let's begin the challenge, shall we? We begin in a field, and my first thought was to obviously play the game normally, and see where it goes from there. Also, if you do not know the rules of this mob drop challenge, you can go into the description where I have laid out all the rules. My plan was to use the map to just travel to the end of it, and if I didn't find anything, then oh well. As I was getting to the end of the map, I looked into the distance and saw a village. It was like, it was like a miracle. I, I promise this video isn't scripted. After exploring and looting the entire village, I decided that I would go down and collect some materials for some tools that I would need later on. After gathering everything that I needed, it was now finally time for me to get the armor and weapons that I would need from mobs. But before the sun fell, I decided to travel to this ruined portal to see what it had, and to my surprise, the chest had stuff I, that I could not use. So I went into a cave, and uh, we don't talk about that. After coming back from shamelessly retrieving my stuff, the sun had finally fallen, and I could find some armor and I kid you not as soon as I walk over a hill I find another ruined, por ruined portal I swear this video was scripted after fighting pretty much throughout the entirety of the night I died to a creeper and whilst travelling back I found this zombie wearing half chain and once I killed him he dropped the chain armour. I had finally gotten my first pieces of armour, I went back to my loot and collected it all. I now had two pieces of armour but I needed more if I wanted to go into the nether so I decided to look out for some more and some weapons as well. I found these two zombies on land and I tried to drive them towards the water. See, there was something I didn't do in the last episode, and the last world, that I didn't even know about until uh, this moment. But if a zombie drowns, it drops its armor. So that was my plan. My plan was to drip bring them into the water, and because they can't really swim, they just stick down there, and it will give me the armor. This drowned dropped all of its armor with pretty decent durability on it, and it had an enchanted helmet and leggings. But now I had the armor, all I needed was a weapon, and I could finally enter the nether. I decided that I was going to use the big nether portal near the village to make the nether portal out of, and uh, it, let's just say it didn't go to plan. Um, You're honestly an idiot! You're an imbecile! Yeah, so it was pretty obvious that wasn't gonna work. So then I decided to go to the other nether portal and uh, there was no lava in sight for some reason. At this point, I didn't know what to do and then I came up with an idea. I would go into a cave and look for either diamonds or a lava pool so I could just keep bringing the lava up and down like I did in the 
in the first world but uh, I would not be able to do that this time because this cave was underwater obviously there was going to be no lava and I'm not risking that for diamonds as I was walking out of the cave I look in the distance and I see some light and that could only mean one thing that it was a lava pool and I was right I made sure this time to make the nether portal far away from the lava pool so if I did mess up I wouldn't get rid of all the lava The nether portal was complete, but I still didn't have a flint and steel, so I had to go back and get some materials to make it. I then decided that it was time to enter the nether and see what it looked like without a weapon. But you're going to have to wait until the next video to find out what happened and what kind of spawn I got. I'll give you a little hint though, it was looking pretty similar to the first one, but thankfully I was alright. Anyways, that is the end of this episode. Next episode is probably going to come out like next week or something. See you then.